All right, guys, what's up, everybody? We are back into Hogwarts Legacy. Today, we gotta go find Scrope in the courtyard. And if you missed out the on the Revenue. last episode, we've been doing all kinds of things. We checked out a little village. We fought a goblin compound. We ran across some spiders and wolves. We solved some Merlin um, puzzles. <laughs> now we gotta go find this, uh, this house elf and talk to him. These large ornate hourglasses contain rubies, diamonds, sapphires, and emeralds are enchanted to keep count of house points for Gryffindor, Hufflepuff, Ravenclaw, and Slytherin, respectively. Who's winning? Can't tell. That is so cool. Huh. Huh. Alright, so this is an entire new wing to discover. And I'm gonna just have to do it later the hogwarts architect shown here surrounded by the four house mascots designed and oversaw the construction of hogwarts castle alongside founder rowan uh, uh, ravenclaw who is credited with creating its ever-changing floor plan this guy was a genius i just hit level 17 so that means that I can put on my better inventory. This is taking me forever. I apologize. It means I can wear this stuff now. Which this stuff does. I'm not going to put those on because they're not better. Um, check out my scarves. I can't put this on now. There we go. Check out my gloves. We can put these gloves on. Um, my robe, this robe is not better, my outfit, okay, my hat, all right, and then, uh, glasses again, one more time, all right, actually, I think I upgraded my appearance. Fly! Let's get the hell out of here. We spend so much time in damn Hogwarts. Faculty top is tower? What is this? It said enter. Hidden behind the statue of a one-eyed witch is a secret passageway, passageway from Hogwarts to the cellar at Honeydukes. It can only be accessed during a particular... Or using a particular charm. I like how it said that, but as soon as I ran up on here, it told me to to use. All right, I don't know what I need to use to get rid of the the witch. Bavelio. Oh, it's a mouth. Hello, kitty. I'm getting distracted. I'm getting really distracted. Is this even the right way? Yes. Okay. Imagine. This portrait depicts the wizard Barufio, famed for his brain elixir, and as an example of what happens when incantation and properly spoken are improperly spoken. He once said S instead of F and found himself on the floor with a buffalo on his chest. Oh. He was trying to do a brain, uh, summon a brain potion or, or a brain spell and ended up conjuring a buffalo. It crushed him. Rebellion. Uh, ooh, what's this? Oh, I don't want to enter that. We could do that some other time. I've been in this place before. Do not know what this is yet. Got a kitchen on fire. Incendio. Not okay. I bet you that's the rumor requirement. He left me a note. Scrope knows about the book he found. It is missing something. Scrope does not believe it is safe to speak out in the open. 
Scrope has left another note across the bridge among the circle of rocks. Take care, tell no one about this. Oh, this is suspicious. Scrope? Who is Scrope? Exactly, who the hell is Scrope? Is this a trap? Because someone owns Scrope. Scrope isn't a free elf. Oh. This is rather suspicious. Levioso. Okay. Revelio. What is this? Why are these boxes all around uh, right here? Akio. Oh. Okay. Almost there, head for the pumpkins, just down the stone circle. Look inside one of them. You may be able to help poor broken-hearted Scrope. Pumpkins? Oh, I think I know just the place. Poor broken-hearted Scrope? What's wrong with Scrope? <sighs> Rest in peace, Hagrid. Rest in peace. What the hell? Revelio. Here it is. The young Slytherin must be exceptionally curious by now. Meet Scrope at the water's edge by the broken docks. Oh, I know where Down that is. Down to the water's edge. Hmm. This funny. had better not be a trick. It's funny, because this is... Every, all the places I went to in the last episode. <sighs> Oh, maybe Scrope's gonna help me figure out what the circle thing is. Accio. Oh. Scrope is <coughs> missing it here. Thank ear. you for coming all this way. The name's Scrope. Scrope serves the headmaster. Been in the Black family for years. Apologies for the abundance of notes. Scrope wanted to be sure you weren't followed. What's this all about? Your notes mentioned the book I found in the restricted section. Scrope can tell you more in exchange for your help, but no one, especially the headmaster, can know. I'd rather not risk trouble. the trouble with Black. Happy to undermine authority if it benefits me, of course. What can I do with for you? Mm. So it appears that that Black, the headmaster, is not taking care of his poor, defenseless little house elf. And I'm not going to take anything from this house elf. He has nothing. We're going to help this little buddy out. Happy to help, especially if you can shed light on the book. Scrope is grateful. Scrope's late mistress, Apollonia Black, may she rest in peace, was a student at Hogwarts uh, over 50 years ago. Before she died, she spoke with passion of pages ripped from a book. Scrope suspects she took them to her private grotto. She was delirious at the end, poor oh. thing. Mistook Belladonna for elderberries. <laughs> Scrope tried to warn her. I'm sorry to hear that. But how do you benefit if I find the pages? Scrope believes that a treasured Black family ring is also in the grotto. Scrope wishes to give it to the headmaster. Apollonia forbade Scrope from entering the grotto long ago. Scrope continues to honor her wishes. Scrope would not dare ask a student for help. But when Scrope learned you were looking for those pages, Scrope thought you might also find the ring. I like Scrope. How do you know about the book I found? How did you know that I'd found a book? And that it's missing pages? Scrope and the other house elves are good at staying out of sight. Scrope hears and sees many things in the castle. Scrope knows how to keep secrets. Hmm, tell me about the ring. Tell me more about this treasured ring. Oh, it's adorned with the Black Family Crest. The headmaster would be pleased with Scrope for returning it. How did you injure your ear? The Blacks have a tradition of decapitating their house elves when their service is no longer required. What? 
One day, dear Apollonia was understandably frustrated with Scrope and got a bit too eager with a cleaver. Scrope was able to convince the sweet girl of his value and now views this small injury as a reminder of her good heart. That is terrible. It seems this may help us both. I shall do it. Scrope is relieved. Scrope hoped the young Slytherin would be willing to help. Take this toast to the grotto just down the coast and place it on the pedestal there. <gasps> Good luck. Are you kidding? Everywhere Scrope I went in that right last episode. Here. Best of luck finding your pages and the ring. Every single place I went in that last episode is exactly where I'm... <laughs> oh my goodness. So in the last episode, I found this cave over here and I was like, hmm, I bet you something goes there. Now look at look at me. Whoa! Whoa! No 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 no! Let me also. Let me also. No! I need to dodge that. No, where? I'm not. I'm done. I'm done. Oh. Man! Thank goodness about the elder, uh, the elder one. Oh, there's another stone back bog. Let's hit him with this. Come on, come on, I'm ready this time. I'm ready. Woo! Woo! Oh no, he got me. Send me up. There we go. Hit him with the rock. Woo! Come on, damn frog. Finish him off. Woo! God, come on. Oh god. Oh god, these, these things are vicious. Vicious. Dueling feet too, which is great. Oh. Revelio. Did I defeat one over here? Those things were pretty brutal. They weren't here last time. Okay. I don't know if there's any special spell that I need to fight those things with, which I think I can look in my uh, my. Hogwarts book to figure out. Which I'll do after this. Okay. I should have thrown those cabbages far sooner. Maybe the cabbages is the weakness. Why would I need a piece of toast? I suppose that's where it goes. Piece of toast? What is this going to do? Magical toast. I am bread. Oh! I just fed the creature? Whoa! Secret entrance! That is so cool! Revelio! Oh, it's, it's her journal. So she passed away, by the way. Could it be? A visitor? What the hell? Oh. Oh. Ah. Ooh. <laughs> Richard Jackdaw. Ah. 
The name's Richard Jackdaw. I was a student, just like you, about a century ago. How in the world did you find this place? A house elf named Scrope sent me. Said I might find a black family ring here. Ah. Sorry to say I sold the ring a long time ago. Poor Scrope. Still holds a candle for Apollonia, I reckon. Can't say I blame him. I stole all these treasures just to impress her. Alas, twas to no avail. I thought a secret map I pilfered from Peeves would pique her interest. But she simply rolled her eyes. What would I want with yellowed old pages torn from a book? Uh. Not my finest moment. Where are they? Uh, may I have them? I'd like to have those pages if you don't mind. They're not here. I thought if Apollonia wasn't interested in the map on the pages, perhaps it would lead to something that would intrigue her. So, I followed the map to what I can only describe as an enchanted cave of some kind. And you see what happened next. Here's an idea. Why don't you meet me at the edge of the Forbidden Forest, and I'll show you where to find the pages. Forbidden Forest, really? Uh, how did you lose your head? We, I mean, that's important information if we're going to the same place. I think I can guess how you died, but who did it to you? I was having a look around when I suddenly sensed a refreshing breeze. After that, I felt, well, light-headed. That's all I remember. Hence, if you do visit the cave, be prepared. I can't tell you what for specifically, but you seem a perceptive sort. Beware a light breeze. Okay, why the toast? Why did I need the toast to get in here? Oh, that was Apollonia's idea. Seems some squids love toast. They should have taught you that at Hogwarts. Okay, why did you steal from Peeves? How is Ow. it possible to steal from Peeves? A poltergeist? I didn't steal the pages from his ghostly form. I merely found them in his wake of destruction. He has a penchant for wrecking things. Books, bottles, suits of armor. Whatever's sure to cause the most chaos. He dropped them after a particularly aggressive romp through the library. Okay. I suppose if that's the only way for me to get those pages, I'll meet you at the forest. I'm sure the pages are still tucked in my waistcoat. If you don't mind the sight of a, well, my decapitated skeleton, they're yours for the taking. Ooh, I'll check this place out. Revelio. Ooh. What is this? So it looks like a town. I gotta use my light to light the candles on the end of a bridge. And then we got a forest right here. Wait a minute. Wait a minute, this is... This is where he wants me to go. Because I remember this. Okay. Yeah, that's where mm, he wants me to go. The map. It doesn't appear to be connected to the missing pages. Best hang on to it for now. What is that? Is that something? Accio. Oh, okay. Alright. Well, we gotta return the scrope and tell him um, that the ring is not here. He's gonna be so heartbroken. By the way, I love this game. I do. Rebellion. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. Jump. Jump. Scrope. I have terrible news, little, little, little elf buddy. Hello, Scrope. Thanks to you, I was able to enter Apollina's grotto. The toast was the key. I met a ghost there, Richard Jackdaw, who's agreed to lead me to the pages I've been looking for. Oh, that boy was never good enough for Apollonia. Oh, what of the Black Family Ring? I'm sorry to say that Jackdaw sold it long ago. Sad news indeed. Scrope shall need to think of another way to impress the headmaster. Well, 
Scrub takes some consolation in knowing that the young Slytherin found what they needed. I did. Thank you again, Scroop. You're a credit to House Elves. Poor Scroop. I feel bad for him. That's four out of six of the main mission. Or at least for right now. Uh, let's check out our missions. See what we got. Or our quests. Ghost of our love. So, use the map with floating candles to find the treasure. Let's go ahead and do that one. So he wants to go to, um... I, I can actually just, uh, just go there right now. Up here. The Forbidden Forest. There we go. Our first time in the Forbidden Forces is uh Handy resource indeed, your field guide. Interesting. I'm most pleased to be included. Okay, uh oh here it is. Alright, so it wants me to use Um my light. So let's go ahead and put that on. Lumos. Use the map with floating candles to find the treasure. Revelio. So the treasure is going to be in here somewhere. Oh, I sense a villain. Lumos. Oh, it's one of those bogs. Ministry of. Rebellion. Oh, that's a big boy right there. Man, I don't think he can get up here. Come on! Come on! What was wrong? 240 damage with burn. He's got some burn damage. We're almost up here. Woo! Woo! Incendio. There we go. Can't get up here. Nice. Rebellion. Wish it was daytime. You've had too much fire whiskey if you think you can outdo my take. Could hardly carry the sacks on that last raid. I'm not gonna mess with those guys over there. Alright, let's um Map portrays a forest, bridge, and candles. I put it into my bag for references. Okay, so let's let's check out the bag. So we need to go to my inventory right here, and here you. So we saw this. Hmm. I'm a bit confused. Was I supposed to go through this? So the forest is right here. The village right here. I'm a bit confused. Be off to the tent. They come after me. They'll rest in ten. Wait grades. a minute. Revelio. What is this? There's something over here. <gasps> This, this, oh, is this the spiders? Look at that. That's the spiders. Maybe one of those little spiders is one of the ones that Hagrid found and raised.
maybe it doesn't want me to go through that. Hmm. Let me look at my let me look at my missions again. Yeah, because I'm confused. Jack dude's re rest. Meet Richard Jack Dude in the Forbidden Forest. Use the map with floating candles to find the treasure. Huh. Okay, maybe all right. I'll I'll just do the main mission because yeah, I don't I don't. I mean, it seems like there's the there's the forest. There's the thing. There's supposed to be a bridge somewhere. I don't think there's a bridge this way. Bridge with the candles. Yeah, I, I'm confused. A bit confused with that. Unless it meant this bridge right here. Oh. My dearest Apollonia, would you care to join me for a picnic? I know you enjoy a good Cornish pasty almost as much as you enjoy a good mystery. See you soon. I hope yours, Richard. How long was this love letter been there? Okay. So, this was a good start. Crap! This is gonna take me forever. I, I already feel this is gonna take me forever because I don't understand. I don't understand it. Okay. Lumos. Revelio. Yeah, I need to be careful. A lot of villains. Fireflies. Here I am, as good as my word. We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. I suppose I shouldn't be surprised to see you. It took the cunning of a Slytherin to track down these pages. Well said. Now where do we go from here? Follow me. I shall lead you as far as I can, but I fear I may remain a tad reluctant to revisit the scene of my demise. Keep your eyes open for a birdbath. When you find it, say Intramuros. I think it's Latin. Or Greek. As you can imagine, I never paid much attention in school. Shall we? We shall. Jack do's rest. Aside from the birdbath, anything else I should look for? Indeed. A few landmarks, a stone bridge, a waterfall, and, if I recall, a lake. You'll see. You've been very helpful. Thank you. Revelio. Okay. Uh-oh. There's a bunch of items over there. What am I hearing? Oh, this place is creepy. Surprising how much of this is rather unfortunately coming back to me. Forbidden forest. Oh no. This is bad. I'm gonna fight giant spiders. Lumos. Oh no, spider webs. Hmm. Yes. You know. The closer we get, the more I'm remembering. Probably best I leave you to it. Simply stick to the path and keep a sharp eye out for that bird bath. Adieu. Is that Latin? Or Greek? Hmm. Oh no. Okay. I don't know if I'm ready for this. I don't know. <laughs> Thornback Hatchling? Revelia. Shot, just kill it. Oh my god! Revelia. Oh, 
that's a big one. Let me Can't pick it up. But I can't burn it. Right. Burn. Keep going. Revelio. It's by us. This is creepy. Incendio. Revelio. Right. Sure, there ain't no bad guys nearby. There's something in the water. I definitely want to check that Waterfall. out. Waterfall. For a thief, Jackdaw's surprisingly as good as his word. Alright. I'm going to check out the water right here. See what's in the water. Fur coat is better than what I got on right now. Rebellion. Danger. Caution, centaurs. Oh, are we going to see a centaur in here? This. This place is creepy, man. Lumos. Revelio. Puffskin? Is that a cat? Lumos. Accio. Oh my god, it's so cute. Like a little puffy kitty. Oh my goodness! Rebellion. Oh my goodness, they get so cute! That's the cutest thing I've ever seen in my life! Alright, um... I guess I can't do anything with the puff skins right now. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna kill them. Is this the lake where Harry Potter used his pat uh, Patronus at? Something oddly solemn about this place. Such regal creatures, stags. No way it is. Revelio. Just as Jackdaw described. Jackdaw's tomb. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. I think I gotta... Oh. So we whispered the password. Okay, let's... Uh... Can I? Incendio! Oh, we can burn that. Oh, cool. Revelio. Alright. There's nothing else. Trying to see if there's anything in the water that I can swim out to and grab. It does not look like it. 
Might be over there. All right, let's do the password. Intramuros. Lumos. That is so cool. Oh. Aren't you a little far from home? Renrock knew you'd eventually lead us to whatever it is you're hiding. Attack! Oh. Let me ah. 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 Woo! You won't That was you know pitiful! Oh. oh god! Oh. Just finish him? Completely obliterated that guy. Let me Revelio. No risk for those loyalists will report back to Ranrock now. Let's see where Jackdaw has led me. Scholar's robe. This is awesome. This game is amazing. I wonder how big this place is. Oh. What's this? Horn club? Hork lump. Oh, I am Batman. We have found the Batcave. Oh, here he is. Is this him? Maybe not. Revelio. Someone got crushed there with some spiders. Okay. This place is massive. Hmm. These runes must have something to do with opening this door. Yes. Incendio. Fire one. Fire two. I can shoot the symbol, Fire but three. it doesn't stay lit for long. Oh. Oh, okay, 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 okay. I need to light all three before they time out on me. This one, this one, and then this one. I've created a bridge. Impressive. That must be where this all leads. It is a crazy magical universe. Love it. This is that symbol that she's been seeing Someone too. didn't want casual visitors down here. I wish this game had photo mode. Uh oh. Revelio. Got spiders. Okay. I wonder if any of my spells will help me through this. Okay, before we get in here, mm, I could turn invisible. And sneak by them, but no, nah, I don't want to do that. Let's put this up here just in case. Incendio! Revelio! Ready. I'm not afraid. Let me use Take Stupefy! Stupefy! I think me hitting him with the Spelliamo um takes his fangs out. Revelio. Alright, so it needs me to go down that way. What's over here? See a bunch of babies. Are they not gonna? Oh, they're running. I'm not going to touch those. Ugh. Oh. Hit another enemy with a spider explosion. Complete the battle without using a potion? Okay. 
Ready to crush those guys. Oh. Get off me! Oh, I, I shrunk them? Crack it! Oh. I didn't do any of the dueling feats, so I did one, but completely destroyed those spiders. Revelio. Secret cave. Now, I'm going to go ahead and say this. By the way, this room is creepy. Is that a person? That's a person. I'm going to go ahead and say this. If I do know for a fact, if I save the game right now, and then I open this and I don't like what's in it, I can reload the game. It changes every time. You get a random item every time you open a box like this. But I'm not going to do that. I'm going to play legitly. I get what I get. All right. Let's see what we get. Come on. Give me some good. Leather Sorcerer's Hat, and it's an upgrade. Check it out. Um, yeah. Check out the gear. Uh, the hat's right here. Oh, it's a huge upgrade. 47, so I go up to uh, 10 defense. No, it's not bad. It's not bad. It doesn't match the color of the outfit like the last hat did. But it's not bad. It's not bad. But that give, that's being said, I can change back. Let me actually check my hat. Ooh, goblin made helmet. Where did I get that? I got a bunch of hats. I got hats on hats. I don't need hats. Go. All right. Continue. Honor it on my journey to vanquish all the spiders in here. Revelio. What the hell? This is not the way to go, but what is this? I wonder if I can move that platform somehow. I wonder too. Oh, oh that freaked me out. Where'd the other ones go? Not a headless skeleton in sight, but I may as well help myself to this. Should be able to should be able to pull that. Right. Now I wonder if I'm gonna be coming back because there are some flowers down there I don't have. Ooh. Before I open this, I need to make sure, because I don't want that same mistake. I need to make sure I got room. My gear slots. So it appears I got 24 out of 24. So yes, let's let's delete. I'm gonna delete like two things. Two or, two of my cheaper things. I gotta be like 60. Ooh, what's this? All right, 60. Uh, yeah. Let's destroy this. Let's destroy this. And let's destroy this. Untouched chest. Chapter wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. We got uh, some glasses that are an upgrade. Revelio.
Ah. All right, there's a chest over there. Uh, let me get these flowers. Get me leaves. Okay. And then there was a chest nearby behind this wall. Rebellion. I am confused. Ha. I feel like I just now looked at everything. There's no way. Like, why is there a chest in the wall right there? Rebellion. Right. What? Huh. Wait a minute. Akio, Levioso. Uh, I guess I can't remove that. I thought maybe I could jump in that that hole right there. All right, I don't know. I don't know. It looks like a regular chest. Very interesting. Oh, a broom. I bet you I could get it by bringing a broom in here or something. I bet you can't fly a broom in here. Uh-oh. Woo, boys! The head down! There's a victory that came... Another puzzle. Well... If Jackdaw could solve this, so can I. Yes. All right. So. Incendio. Oh. I didn't need to use fire. I just needed to shoot it. Question is if Jack went through here, why did everything get reset? Pavelio. Oh, it is spiders. Creepy crawlies. Revelia. Revelia. A big maze of doom. I, I am sorry, spider friends. I thought Jackdaw would have been interested in this loot, but there's no sign of him. Revelia. Maybe he didn't really come in here. And it's a trap. Akio. Ah. Revelio. Jackdaw didn't fall down there. Rebellion. Accio. Okay. Rebellion. That's the way it wants me to go. What is this way? Before I open the chest, we need to I need to make sure how many gear slots I have. Um 23 out of 24. Here, I need to go ahead and 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 chop some other stuff down. So yeah, let's destroy this. 22, 150, 
200. We are not selling any of those or destroying any of those. Plenty of stuff to destroy in here, I believe. Maybe not. Hey. Okay. Glasses are an upgrade. There's nothing for me to destroy. Hmm. All right, destroy this. Destroy this. And destroy that. Okay. Not a headless skeleton in sight, but I may as well help myself to this. Wait in the... Spider eggs? Complete the battle in 40 seconds. What? Things everywhere. Ooh, what's this? Incendio. An untouched chest. Jackdaw wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. It's almost like he wasn't Revelio. in the cave. Incendio. Wait a minute. Levioso. Alright, um, so I guess I go back. Thought it was gone. Is simply too many. I'm not paying attention to the dueling feats. Not on purpose. I just I'm not noticing them. That's odd. I'd have thought Jack Dor would have been interested in this loot. But there's no sign of him. What was in that one? I didn't even see anything in that one. Revelia. Okay, so there's some chests down there. We're getting plenty of spider fangs in this cave. Can I actually get this one? Got it. Not a oh. headless skeleton in sight, but I may as well help myself to this. Revelio. Right, so there's a chest up there that I have not received yet. This is crazy. I think it's this thing that I'm standing on is making noise. Revelio. British gloves, cash monies, a rare valuable tombstone that I'm going to destroy. 
Revelio. Whoa. So cool. There's so much treasure. I'm glad Richard Jackdaw left a little something behind for me, but where could he be? An untouched chest. Jackdaw wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. Revelio. Before we open that big chest over there, we got new gloves. Um, I'm going to break these gloves down because I had too much gear again. And we're going to put these on. Oh, those are cool. Or weird. <laughs> God, I can see, see everything in every direction. I think Jack is using me. Revelio. Okay. Healing potions. Leather long coat. Hell am I? This place just keeps going. Oh, all right. So this is the beginning. Okay. Um, how do I get in there? Right here. Oh, right here. There it is. The bridge. It's almost complete. More spiders. This can't be what the head of Richard Jackson. Little buggy, little buggy. Oh! Stupefied. Stupefied. Oh! Ooh. Shame you're so uh -oh. foul. Oh my goodness, we got a boss fight. We got a spider boss fight. Ooh. Oh my god! Oh, it hurt! It hurt! It hurt. Destroyed him! I need my cabbages. Cabbages, help me! Help me, cabbages! Boom! Woo! Akio! Incendio! Farewell, monster. I can only imagine how these spiders have multiplied since Jackdaw came this way. I don't think he's been here. Revelio. Alright. Oh! Mallow Sweet! Not a headless skeleton in sight, but I may as well help myself to this. Revelio. Okay, so there I'll are need three. To look around for the symbol. Let's get over here because I can shoot all of them. One. Two. this this is like doing these things completely changes the scenario of the game it makes me feel like I'm even playing a different game there's something down there Ooh. 
That looks crazy. Okay, let's uh let's make sure we got Oh yeah, yeah, this is the Rocky Skin potion. I have not used that yet. Revelia. I must be getting closer to Jackdaw's remains. And those pages. It's like a statue fight. We got some gear. We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. Oh, here he is. Thank you for keeping these pages safe all these years. So he was here. Oh, I see what happened. He got destroyed by the statues. Revelio. Before we check that out. Loosen scarf. Okay. Here's slot Merlin challenges to increase your gear slot. We have a new scarf. Right here. I'm going to go ahead and destroy it. Can't wear it. There's another 90 in here. Right here. We're going to destroy this one. And destroy this one. There's a lot of gold I'm destroying, which sucks. By the way. But it'd be worth it to pick up some good loot. Wait a minute. What was that? That was something good. 42. It's a better cloak. <laughs> it's the fur coat again. Are you kidding? It really wants me to wear the fur coat. Alright, and we're gonna destroy this. Right. Fur line cap. Alright, I'm ready. Here it is. The map that brought your doom, Jackdaw. Hmm. Is there something beyond this room? A spiral? Uh-oh. Revelia. Uh-oh. Go ahead. And... Oh! Took his own head off! Stupid guy. Because... Oh! Oh, I didn't see him jump in the air. They were the pensive protectors. I've seen this before in Gringotts and the restricted section.
Revelio. Right, there's nothing Where here. Where am I? Very mysterious. Oh no. Uh -oh. The room is starting to flood. It's filling with water. What? How am I being protected? What sort of magic is this? Oh, that's so cool. Walking underwater. I can only hope this magic protects me until I'm able to make my way out of here. What is this place? Speak of the devil. Wild. Rebellion. Boss fight? Big boss fight? The, a really big open room. Can it be? It's you. Has someone finally found our map chamber? I recognize you from the pensives. You're Professor Rackham. I am indeed. I must confess that I am surprised to see someone so young standing before me. I'm the same age that you and Isadora Morganark were when you started at Hogwarts. You've paid attention. And might I presume you share our ability? To see traces of ancient magic? Yes, sir, I do. As you have likely realized by now, our ability gives us a unique relationship with all forms of magic. We can access expressions of magic that few others can. Opportunities will arise that allow you to sharpen this rare talent. Do not squander them. I won't, Professor. Thank you. We have much to discuss, but first, a map found in a certain book led you here. Place the book on the pedestal. I don't have the book with oh, me, no. sir. Hmm, that is unfortunate. I'm afraid we must pause our conversation until you return with the book. Why is this called the map chamber? I'm a bit confused, sir. Why is this room called the map chamber? I assure you that all will be clear once the book has been placed on the pedestal. Okay, are you a seer? The statues and carvings in the house on the cliffside, those are of you. Are you a seer? I am. Did you know that I would be here? I cannot say more at present, except to say that your presence here does not entirely surprise me. Okay, I'll bring the book here. Very well. I'll retrieve the book right away. Good. We shall speak again once the book is in place. That's so awesome. Your connection to ancient magic has unlocked talents plus one. You receive one talent point each time you increase your wizarding level. You have new talent points to spend in the talents menu in your field guide. Talent? Earn a talent point starting at level 5. You may spend these talent points as you wish to enhance your spells to increase your combat powers, stealth, and more. Choose wisely. Talent points may only be spent once, so the number of talents you acquire will be limited. Return here often to see what new powerful talents await you. The Dark Arts. Ooh. Spells. Dark Arts Core. Stealth. Room of requirements. Oh my god, I don't know what to choose. Let's look in the uh let's look in the core first. I just want to look at things. I'm gonna take some time looking at all these. So level 22 is required. 
for Protego Mastery and Stupefy Expertise. Level 16, level 5. Alright, so it, goes, it starts from the bottom. So, Spell Knowledge. So, this unlocks... A, a new spell set is added. Hold right trigger and tap a direction to swap and to unlock spells. So, I can switch to different sets of spells. That way, I don't have to keep switching them over and over. That's actually pretty good. Ancient Magic Throw Expertise. Ancient Magic Throw catches and throws disarmed enemy weapons. Okay. Basic cast. Impacts reduce spell cooldowns. Successful uh, protection blocks will contribute to an Ancient Magic Meter. Per perfect Protego blocks contribute even more. So it adds to my Magic Meter. Oh, that's pretty cool. Swift, holding down dodge allows you to vanish quickly and reappear nearby. What? Spell knowledge, two. Hold right trigger and tap in a direction to swap and unlock spell set. Let me look at that again. So he swaps. Oh, okay. Gives you greater, all right. So 100%, I do want spell knowledge. I want swift, and I want... I want this one. What's the dark arts give me? What is this? The blood curse. Dealing damage to a cursed target inflicts damage to all cursed targets. Stunning curse. Stupefy has the same effect as a curse on enemies. Cursed enemies take increased damage. So when I stupefy one, it counts as a curse. And then when I hit them, it does extra damage. Has the same effect of cursed on enemies. Cursed enemies take increased damage. What is this one? Enduring curse. A cursed effect remains on an enemy for a longer period of time. And then we get up here in the upper dark art. Oh my goodness. Do I want to be able to kill? Do we want to go d down the dark arts path? Stealth. Let's look at stealth. Enemy's ability to detect you is reduced. Allows you to sprint while using dis disillusionment. Enemy's ab ability to detect you is reduced again, and level 22 is emanates an area of effect that can impact nearby enemies. So, being invisible, I can use this attack. Oh, it knocks them out. <gasps> so, if I wanted like a stealth playthrough, which I don't really care about right now, room of requirement. Potion potency. Endurance potion makes you invulnerable and deflects projectile attacks back to enemies. What? For each Chinese chopping cabbage thrown, a second chopping cabbage is generated and released at no cost. Invisibility potions undetectable effect lasts longer for a, a period of time. Let's, let's see what the 22s are. Focus potion. Effect will be extended. Venomous, whatever this is. Oh, it's like a turret? Alright. I don't care about any of those. Uh, I want to read the 22s in the course. Perfect Protego releases a damaging blast that breaks enemy shields. Stupefy deals direct damage on impact. Oh, that's amazing. And then spells. Casting Incineo unleashes a ring of flame around you. Enemies near a target summoned by Asio are also pulled to you. So I can pull three of them. Enemies near a target levitated by Levo uh, uh, Leviosa are also... This sounds amazing. I feel like I need one of these. I got 14 points. Let's get this. Let's get this. 
and this one. Okay. Alright. So my spells are more powerful. Now, let's get this. Hold on, hold on. Which one is it? Yeah, let's get this one for the stupefy curse. Let's get this one so that when they're cursed, they hurt more. And then we'll also get this one. Why not? And this one. I'm going. I'm going for the killing. We're going for the killing of enemies. They come. They they, they attack me. How dare they attack me? And then we'll, we'll, we'll play around with the core as well. So, let's get holding down dodge allows you to vanish quickly and reappear nearby. Okay. Let's get the new spell set. Alright, and we'll do this one because perfect protegos um, contribute to my ancient meter. Right, let's read some of these. Basic cast impacts in, in, on airborne enemies contribute more to the ancient magic meter. Blocking a spell will send two projectiles back at enemies. Oh my goodness. That sounds powerful. I'm getting that. Successfully evading an unblockable attack with dodge contributes to ancient magic meter. Enemies stuck, struck with stupefy, remain stunned for a longer period of time. I don't care about the healing potions. All right, so right now I got one spell set. I don't need a second spell set as of right now. Increase the range of reveal. Mm, I want this one. So that means we get ancient meter more often. Range of Reveal sounds... I use it all the time. Hmm. Ancient Magic Throw catches and throws disarmed enemy weapons. Ancient Magic Throw catches... Disarm... What? Hmm. Basic cast reduces spell cooldown, so you use more cooldown more often. I don't think I need this Revelio Mastery right now. I don't I want it, but I don't think I need it. Okay. Um. My stealth again. I can sneak. Blah blah blah. What is this one? Level sixteen. Alright, I don't care about any of that. I don't care about the potions, dark arts. I got everything in dark arts that I can get right now. I guess I will go with something in here. Successfully evading an unblocked attack contributes to ancient magic meters. Yeah, let's go with that one. Okay. I think I got I think I selected some good ones. I think we selected some good ones. That was awesome. That was really awesome. Now we gotta exit the the map chamber. Revelio. Anything else to reveal in here? Exit. I found the pages and the map chamber. Why would I need the book? Revelio. Oh, we got a flu? Off on another adventure, are we? A new flu flame? Where the hell are we? Um. Oh, wait a minute. Here, let's do this. So now that we got a second thing this um let's put the invisibility spell right there awesome 
So this means I can start putting my uh, non-attacking stuff on this page. Like, oh, this is so good. So good. Avelia. 500 galleons. 500 galleons. Can I, uh... Incendio! Caught them both on fire at the same time. So my Incendio does an a is an AoE attack now. I'm back at Hogwarts. I wonder when Professor Fig will be back. I did promise him I wouldn't they... neglect my studies while he was away. Hmm. Mermaid Suppose boobies. I have enough to distract myself with till he returns with the book. Accio. Hey. Revelio. I have no idea where we are. Hmm. Suspiciouser, suspiciouser. A whole new area. Got a key placement right here. Can't get in there. Something up there. Ooh. We know exactly where this goes. Come here, little, little key fly. All right, smack it right in the middle. And... Come on, come on, come on. Yes. Got it. Perfect. All right. Time to see where the hell we are. Revelio. Another room I can't get in. A bunch of cauldrons in front of that room. Another Yo, look at this. The Hogwarts motto Draco Dorm Dormians um that's a long name. Means never tickle a sleeping dragon. Fortunately, the uh, this particular sleeping dragon is made of stone and will never awaken. It will be tickled to absolutely no effect. We wake it up. Revelio. This is going upstairs. Come on. And... <laughs> the poor key. Come on, switch across. There we go. Rebellion. This particular urn is rumored to have once borne the inscription Pine Pioneer in Dragon Taming. Should not have started with the Hungarian Horn Tail. Wonder why that is. Revelio. the hell am I? There's another key. It went way to the top. Right here. I, I can't say I'm making progress with these things. I found three. Okay. Revelio. Still can't get in here. And I still don't know where this is. Well, I'll find that later. But yeah, alright. So, I think 
This is a great spot for me. We call it. This game is awesome. I absolutely love it. I'm having so much fun playing it. Hogwarts. I grew up with Hogwarts. I read all the books, watched all the movies. Did I scare him? Poor house elf was cleaning. That's how this place stays clean. Poor guy. Yes. I'm going to call it right now. I hope you enjoyed the series. Please check out the next episode. And if you haven't seen the other episodes, go watch them. They have been fun. They've been amazing. It's been a lot of adventure. A lot of journeying. A lot of themes. Avenia. But I appreciate you so much. I will catch you all in the next video. Peace out, everybody. Goodbye.